So I'm sitting here editing the video and I realized that my intro, it was too dark for you to pick us up, so I'll do it right now. We're headed down to the beach to go fish the jetty and drop shot some halibut. Um, we know the halibut are there because our good friend Nick Mora put us on them. He went down there two days in a row and caught four halibut. So I went down to our local uh, shark bait chack tackle and it's actually C-H-A-R-K, shark bait. Shark bait tackle and uh, I talked to Betta down there and Betta's a wealth of knowledge. If you guys are in the area and you need some help surf fishing, go there, talk to him, he'll get you dialed. This is the exact setup he recommended for us and it ended up working out. Stay tuned to the end of the video and I'll show you exactly how to rig it up and how we did it. So I uh, hope you enjoy the video. Oh, Pat, I got ripped. I got slammed. Oh, shit. Ah! Yeah, there's bait jumping out there. Hey, Pat, this is gonna soak us. Ah, I got wet, damn it. Here comes another one. I got doused like a fire hose. No! I hope those yellowfin croaker go for those guys. You get them? I'm coming, I'm coming. Take it easy, take it easy. Just take it easy, Pat. Is it really? Keep that rod out away from the rocks. Just keep the rod out away from the rocks. I'm coming down. Is it a good one? Did you see him? Okay. Don't screw me with a wave. Get him right up in here. Coming up. Nah, it's a short. But hey, it's a halibut, man. We got one. It, this, the drop shot technique worked. What do I do? Just bring him, no, bring him to me. I'll tail grab him. I'll try to at least. Hell yeah, Pat. There's a wave coming. I'm getting out of here. Go ahead. Yeah, I'll try him out. Watch that wave. Dude, that's dope. <laughs> Can you? It's 15. Yeah, I'm on that rock right here. Which one? There's another wave. I'm going up on that rock. Get it. Patrick, what the hell are you doing? Just leave him right there. Oh, shoot, I don't have pliers. Okay, bring, everywhere. bring them up here. Look at that, dude. Hell yeah, dude, it worked. Oh, sweet. Can he get that hook out? I think so. Without getting bit. Can I get a picture in there? Yeah. Do you have something to measure? What does it gotta be, 22? 22. 22. Nah, no, it's nowhere near. 19. Oh, we can get him to go here. Yeah! We're on him, Bill. Let's do it. Oh, I got smoked. He's on it. Oh, fuck. Damn it. Dude, he had it in his mouth. He shredded my line. You got him? Another short, dude. Hell yeah. Take it easy, take it easy. They're wild. They're wild. Oh, you, <laughs> you gotta get him out of there. Give me the rod. What a shit show. You got it, he'll die in there.
There you go, Pat. Now just grab the fish by the tail. Woo! Oh, he smoked the what? It's working. Two for two. Back to back cast. Bigger. No. Yeah. Hey, that is bigger, Pat. Get him up on a flat rock. Him over here. Okay. Here, put close his mouth. Just close his mouth. Put that on him. Put that on his mouth. Do it. I, you you got to get that on his mouth. Wait, go. <gasps> That's why you need a flat rock. Nice, nah, twenty-one. I just measure him on a flat rock. What are you doing? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you bastard, Patrick. Every damn time. I'm on. I don't know. Oh. I got one. It's on the rocks. Yeah. Oh. It's chewing me up! Ah! Ah! Oh, no. It's wide open! I was just in the rock. <laughs> There's a million out there, huh? Help me! What do I do? Pin him or something. Put him on the ground or something. Just grab his tail. There we go. I can't hold on to him. He comes off. Can you do that? Yeah. Oh! Hmm. Let him go. Picture, picture. There's mine, guys. I got one. Now we need a legal. We both got the skunk out. Get this guy back. We're trying to get illegal to get some fish tacos. So here we go. Woo! All right, guys, I'm going to show you real quick what you need to start your setup and get yourself drop shot for halibut in the surf. So here we go. All right, guys, so all you need is size one hooks down there. I don't think it matters what color they are or it makes you want a sharp hook, but I don't think the red, the red hook matters too much. Uh, these are... 3 8 ounce ball weights for drop shotting. I also had half ounce weights that they work the same. You got the same amount of bites on each one. The Zoom Flukes, this is going to be your Arkansas Shiner. That was uh, the one I was throwing, but Pat got a lot more bites on this little white one. The Salty Super Fluke with a white pearl chartreuse. That's off camera, so let's get that in there for you guys to see. Pat, Patrick got a lot more bites on this and uh, it, it just produced a, a little bit more fish. I, I wanted to throw this in the dark because of that darker color, and uh, I, I got more bites in the dark than he did. So I'm gonna move on and uh, show you guys how to tie a dropper loop, or dropper loop, drop shot knot. Let's get onto that. All right guys, this is how you draw, tie the knot for the drop shot uh, setup. So you got your hook here, I'm using None of this is going to apply to your halibut fishing. This is a 100 pound mono, just to try and get you guys to see it a little bit better. I don't even know, but this is one of my bluefin tuna hooks. So, you thread your uh, hook through the eye, just like so. Give yourself enough room to work with, and you're going to bring your, your line right back through the eye. And basically what that's going to do is leave you a loop like this. Let your hook slide all the way down that loop, like so. And then you're, you got your loop there. Pinch your loop, let your hook go all the way down, and now you're gonna, this is what you're gonna work with. You got your two ends, your tag end, and your main line, and then wrap that loop right around it about twice. Take this loop that you got and bring it back through the one right by your hook. Right, like so, it goes through, and then you're gonna run your hook through that loop that you brought through. So all that's going to have to come up top. Make sure your line's wet and pull her tight and it'll come together. So it's a lot harder with this 100 pound mono, but it'll come together and it's good to go. 
hey guys thanks for watching hopefully we gave you some information that can help you out in your future fishing adventures and uh, as always we're going to keep the content coming to you guys if you noticed my dad started making videos that we're calling cell phone diaries and we, he's got his own little playlist on our channel so you can check those out and uh we got a tournament tomorrow at Lake Paris, going to go try and take home the W. Patrick's fishing with Mikey. I'm fishing with John McLeod. And, uh, God, we got nothing to go off of. So hopefully we get lucky and catch some fish junk fishing tomorrow. So thanks for watching, guys. And uh, we'll get back to it. Damn it! No, I got smoked by that wave. Look at that. <laughs> it made me fart. 